Philip Akoff uh, joined the board in um, at the end of 2010. Well, I really believe in what the foundation is doing. It made a tremendous difference in my life and my career, and I see it uh, having made a tremendous difference in a lot of my colleagues. Um, I work as a, one of the second round interviewers, and it's really fascinating to get to meet a lot of the incoming students, help the committee decide on uh, who the new uh, fellowship recipients are going to be, and that really just always renews the vision for what the foundation can do. We're, we're really looking for people who have a high level of creativity, are, are passionate about their research, uh, will apply high levels of energy and uh, intelligence and creativity to research over the long run. Not just uh, good grades, not just good test scores, but someone who clearly has a strong commitment and passion for figuring out new things and really making a difference in the world uh, over the long haul. It starts with uh, these symposia, these retreats, and then uh, just getting together with other fellows at the same institution. And there's a, it's fascinating because you get to see so many different types of research going on in different fields, different projects, very creative individuals um, doing some brilliant work. It's always very inspiring. It kind of renews your energy for going back and attacking the problems that you're working on. It also, when you have uh, problems that you're stumped on, it's, it's a great group of people to kind of bounce ideas off of. Um, it's great for uh, networking. It's great for building uh, teams on the project that I work on now which does a lot of work as far as understanding how to uh, uh, help the polio campaign, uh, the global polio eradication campaign, and uh, dealing with malaria around the world. Uh, I work with uh, over, ha over a half dozen Hertz fellows on uh, figuring out these uh, numerical and quantitative aspects for uh, public health.